The final button on the Analysis Wizard toolbar allows me to extrapolate my fitted statistical models. If I wish, I can pick a point within the experimental region and ask the program to generate points outside of the experimental region that lie along the path of steepest ascent. The path of steepest ascent is the path in which I would estimate the desirability of the responses would increase the most for the smallest change in the experimental factors. To do this, I'm going to press the button labeled Step 12 Extrapolate. This will bring up a dialog box on which I can specify how I want the extrapolation to perform. First off, I need to pick the point from which I will begin to follow the path of steepest descent. In this case, I'm going to ask it to begin at the derived optimum. That's the optimal point it's already found. I'll ask it to display changes in the desirability in steps of 1%. So if it starts at 70%, it'll tell me when I get to 71% and 72% and so forth. I also specify the region over which I now want it to extrapolate. And what I've done down here where it says low and high is expanded out that original experimental region. I'll now press OK and then go back to the original analysis summary in the wizard's window. If I scroll down now to where it says Step 12, extrapolate the model, you will see that it's actually been able to increase the desirability beyond the 70% that we saw within the experimental region. You'll see entries for 71%, 72%, and so forth. And looking at the values of the mean strength and the standard deviation, it estimates that it will be able both to increase the mean, get it closer to 250, and at the same time reduce the standard deviation. To see the points themselves, I need to go down a little farther. Here they are, the settings of the factors as it steps along that path of steepest descent. As you can see, it will be dropping the temperature just slightly, increasing the time, increasing the pressure, and maintaining the material at material B. At this point, of course, I'd have to go out, do some confirmatory runs along that path of steepest descent to see if, in fact, the responses really did get better in that direction. That concludes my demonstration of the Design of Experiments Wizard. Now I hope you'll go out and give it a try yourself.